show you how quick a racing motorcycle is, we're going to compare Freddie Spencer's 1984 racing 500 bike around one lap of California's Laguna Seca Raceway with a street bike and a street car. The car is a Nissan 300ZX Turbo with 200 horsepower. It accelerates to 60 miles per hour in seven seconds. The street bike is a 700 Honda Sabre and it hits 60 in four seconds. To make it more interesting, we're giving the street car and street bike a start. The driver of the car is Jacques Couture, chief instructor of a racing school at this track, so he knows every inch of it. The street bike is being ridden by Sam McDonald, a former United States 250cc champion who's won many races here, and he's giving the car a 15 second start. Time for Freddy to put on his gloves. It's coming up to 30 seconds since the car left. And Freddy has to catch the car and the bike before they cross the finish line. And the track is less than two miles long. is now catching the car very quickly. They're both about two-thirds of the way round the track, but the terrific grip and handling of the car means that it will hold off the bike until after the double corkscrew turn. The street bike finally powers past the car, three turns from the finish, but now Freddy is going through the corkscrew. Down this hill, the car will reach 90 miles an hour, but that won't stop Freddy's bike racing past it. Now, there's only one turn left. 